Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'll be explaining to you guys how you can link Amazon Music to Google Home. So let's get right into it. As you can see, I am on the Audi Cable website and I'll be covering some of the methods that they cover in this article, which you can see on my screen. You can, of course, check this article out yourself if you have any other questions, but I'll just be going over the steps on how you can do this. Now, I'll be using the main two methods and the first method is how to use it through an Android device. Now, once you're on an Android device and download the Amazon Music app, if you don't already have it, you just need to open up the app and log into your account, then tap the cast icon at the bottom of the screen, which looks like a TV with the Wi-Fi symbol. Then you just need to choose the Google Home speaker from the list of devices and make sure that they are connected to the same network as your phone is. Once you do that, you just choose a song to play and it should play from, from the Google Home speaker. Now, uh, for the second method, what you need to do is open up Chrome on a PC, go into Chrome and navigate to the Amazon Music landing page, and you might need to sign into your account. And the page is the same for free and paid accounts, but you will need to log in most likely. Then you need to make sure that you are still on the page and tap the three dots in the upper right corner and select cast. Once you're there, a new window called cast tab will open, which will display the current devices on your network. Then you need to find the Google Home device, uh, which is either a Google TV, Chromecast with Google TV device, etc., and click it on the list to select it. Then the Cast tab will display Chrome mirroring to confirm that the browser is casting live, and you just click X to go out of the window. Then you just go back into the Amazon Music website, find a song, click on it, play it, and that's pretty much it. To stop it, you just reopen the Cast menu, highlight the casted device, and select Stopped Casting, and that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll be seeing you guys in another video.